YouTube. So right now I'm recording this video on a Wednesday, but you're probably not watching it until Monday. Just a few hours ago though, the official Brawl Stars YouTube channel posted their second Brawl Talk and in there they mentioned the new brawler, Carl, a new skin coming out within March. And finally, they mentioned the brand new game mode Siege. So in today's video, I'm going to be covering everything in detail, what you can fully expect, and most importantly, what dates slash when to look out for. First things first, we're talking about Carl. So the way they described Carl was a pickaxe wielding geologist from the gem mine. So his main attack, he throws an axe and it's a boomerang and then it comes back to him and he catches it. One thing I found interesting is it's only like a one ammo bar, meaning you throw the axe once and then you can't throw it again until you catch it and then the attack recharges. Right now, all of the brawlers have a three attack bar, so seeing Carl with only one, that's definitely interesting. In terms of his super, he does like a spin attack just like that and it's kind of just a whirlwind of destruction if you're looking at his range it looks pretty damn good so if i had to describe carl i would say it's like a hybrid between the executioner from clash royale and then the valkyrie from clash of clans in clash royale just because like his main attack is a boomerang similar to the executioner and then his spinorama pretty much a Valkyrie. And in terms of when we can expect Carl to be released, they said in the middle of March, and they said the same thing with Gene. Gene came out on like February 14th or February 15th, so I assume Carl is gonna be coming out around that same exact time frame. And to be honest with you, like, I'm really excited for Carl. I didn't catch what rarity he was just by watching the video, but as I'm editing this, if I know the rarity, I'll throw it up on the screen right now. And in my comment section below, let me know what you think about our boy Carl. Do you think he's going to be awesome? Do you think he's going to be kind of bad? Because when Gene came out, they weren't like really overpowered. In fact, I think Gene is kind of underwhelming. But when Carl is released, I feel like it may be the opposite. Because this attack in Super is so different than anything we have now. And I'm just really excited to try it. So please, leave your thoughts down below. And if you're excited for Carl and everything else coming out, in March. Leave a like too. Remember, they're free to give. I like likes. It takes a second to give me one. So give me one. Next up, we're going over the new skin. Uh, they said for Clash Royale's third birthday, they're going to celebrate it in Brawl Stars by giving Mortis a makeover. And essentially, they're making Night Witch Mortis. And when I first saw the skin, I'm like, yeah, this is sick. You know, there's nothing to complain about here. But over on Twitter, I saw Orange Juice post this picture. They're pretty much saying like, hey, the Night Witch you guys made is this is what you should do. So I'll put Brawl Stars like official Night Witch Mortis on the left and then I'll put like the fan art concept on the right. That way we can just like compare the two. And again, I gotta be honest, the right one looks way better. I just like the deeper colors and I feel like everything flows a bit better. But at the end of the day, like I'm just excited to get a new skin. Moving on over to Siege, I'm just gonna explain it exactly how the Brawl Talk explained it. So there's gonna be two safes, similar to heist a safe in your spawn a safe in the enemy spawn and on top of the safe each team is also going to have turrets to help you defend now in order to win this you have to rush to the center of the map and destroy a bunch of boxes so think of this as kind of like heist robo rumble and showdown maybe all mixed into one like they had one gangbang and popped out a massive baby this is what siege is so each team has a safe each team has a turret and in the middle there's boxes when you destroy the boxes you get parts and once you get enough parts you can actually spawn in a robot and the purpose of the robot is to push the enemy's turret and eventually have the robot help you destroy the enemy safe they said this game mode gives you double rewards double xp and double trophies so overall like it's just insane it seems pretty hectic kind of like heist on crack and if you open up brawl stars and go on over to a friendly game you can actually play siege within a friendly battle 
So once we finish the rest of the Brawl talk, I plan on opening up Brawl Stars and playing a game of Siege in this video. The final two things they talked about though in this Brawl talk are a few of the balances. I'm going to throw up all the balance changes right now. I don't know if these are official or unofficial. I saw these posted on Twitter and I don't want to read them word for word, but in the Brawl talk, they said subscribe to the Brawl Stars YouTube channel so Crow can get a buff. And they also said if you sub to the Brawl Stars YouTube channel, Bo just may get a remodel so i'm assuming those are hints at other changes coming within this update as well but at this point we're just gonna have to wait and see so the brawl stars update is out if you go on over to a friendly game and scroll all the way down you'll see that there is siege at the bottom so we're gonna play a game of that in a second but the other thing i want to point out is in the shop there's actually a new welcome pack for five dollars so i figured you know what let's spend five dollars get two mega boxes and see what we get another Another cool feature is heading on over to the online players there's this do not disturb feature uh, you can toggle that on or off uh, I'm just gonna keep it on now because I'm recording and one final thing uh, yesterday Brawl Stars slash Apple leaked the update like in the App Store it said you can update Brawl Stars and it showed all of this stuff before the Brawl Talk was even released but when you updated your game and opened it this is what it showed like nobody was able to play the game it shows all this random text and uh, yeah if you updated your game you were screwed and you couldn't play it so since then Brawl Stars has fixed this they took care of all of the bugs I believe and now the game's back to normal with that being said though let's get this opened come on poppy please oh please give me more to star power in this chest that is what I truly want more to star power would make me so excited it's taking a minute 170 gems here comes the first big box or is it a mega box I don't even know. Let's just open it and see what we get, though. I'm going to go through this a bit quickly because I truly just want to play Siege. But at the same time, I wanted to open these up on video. That way, you can see what I get. And everyone generally likes me spending money. So, there. Those are the two boxes. We got another one. You know what? Let's buy it. Okay, Brawl Stars, please don't take more of my money after this one. If there's another offer after this, I, I don't know if I'm going to buy it. Um truthfully i probably should but uh i don't want to spend more money okay now we have a special offer for uh, a, a token doubler uh, i personally thought that was worth it and now that we have all of that taken care of let's go to a friendly game if if it okay there we go was taking a minute to load there and i'm just gonna share this code on over to twitter delete all the text and okay okay let's type siege i haven't played the game mode before i'll show you my attack log like last thing i played was some solo showdown so i'm just gonna come here scroll all the way down um let's select siege real quickly before too many people join and let's just see all the maps we have available so the first one is bot drop um, seems like the basic map then we have some assembly required and to finish it off nuts and bolts so you know what I think we're just gonna go with the first one bot drop in terms of a brawler let's go with somebody who has who has decent range uh, I think we're gonna go with Jesse Jesse's always a fun brawler who I enjoy what's up brothers I assume it's all guys in here Ryan says I've practiced siege earlier we're putting him on our team I'm trying to you know what we'll put Tony on our team too we're gonna do colored name versus normal that's what I'm talking about here color name versus normal i'm just gonna ready up now once this tony person changes their brawler and hopefully we can get this game started i don't even know what to expect right now okay i'm probably just gonna put one game of siege in this video just so we can get some insight so the next siege is in 40 seconds i assume that oh there's the nuts they were talking about so leon got that which is kind of a pain i'm gonna snag that one there whoa what was that whoa those things fling you in the air holy crap i need to i need to hop on that little jump pad right now and give this a shot you guys see leon right now this is pretty sick i'm gonna toss my turret up right there hopefully he can help us out a little bit oh come on come on there we go turret stay alive okay our turret did decent there i'm really weak we have one bolt slash nut they have four um, I feel a bit weird talking about so many nuts in this video, but it's cool. The enemy team assembled a level 4 seed robot. What does that even mean? Oh, this is so crazy right now. Oh my god, there's a robot. Yeet! How does this work? What the hell? Okay, I had to try that out. Robot, screw you. 
He's just going straight for it. Oh, we have our turret right there. The robot isn't too overpowered. I was expecting him to be baller. But yeah, they just did 20% right off the bat. Whoa, you can put a turret on there? What is this game mode? This is so just crazy. I need to destroy that before I'm dead. Okay, let's retreat a bit. We only have one. They have five at this point. We're doing very bad, team. We are getting ran up on. I feel like fast brawlers with range are going to be kind of kick ass in this game mode. Ryan, push up and get the nut. Get the nut, bro. <laughs> Seriously, though, we need to get this. A level seven robot. Okay, I'm going to put my turret in the back right there. Hopefully, we can do some combos to whatever they decide to throw at us. There's the robot. Oh, no. Crow just got me good. Luckily, we destroyed him, but... Yeah, we're getting kind of blasted right now, and I assume the robot keeps on leveling up every single time. This is a pretty cool game mode. I'm curious to see how it's going to play out in, like, uh, actual matchups, but so far, this is sick. Okay, let's, let's take this slow. I'm going to get the second nut right here. A level 12 robot. What is going on? We only have four. They have, they just assembled a, a big boy for sure. Oh, man. What is this thing? He's taking my turret out, too. How are we going to destroy this guy? The turret's kind of like a mortar. Thing is a beast. They're pushing us now. Okay, let's let's take this one slow. Maybe we can win. Never mind. No. We're not winning. Even though we lost, though. That is a pretty fun game mode. I'm just going to say awesome. Say goodbye to YouTube. Thanks for helping. There's probably some typos in there. I just went rapid fire typing. But, uh, yeah. That's pretty much all I have for today's video. There was a lot of information in it. We talked about a new brawler, a new skin, a new game mode, balance changes, some glitches that happened with the update. So I understand this video was pretty action-packed, but I'm hoping you enjoyed it. I'm hoping you learned something new. But this has been Eclipse. I appreciate you all watching, and peace out.